Hey guys, what's up? I'm Seth. And I'm Megan. And we are with our friend Following Florin. We are here for day number four of five days of food in Arizona. We are at Umami Barbecue and Sushi. Um, we're trying to spread out and get uh, all sorts of different foods in while we're here. So let's go in and let's check it out. You'll notice as soon as you walk into Umami Barbecue and Sushi, just how big this place really is inside. But it doesn't end there because the menu is huge as well. It's also very easy to navigate. The hot tea is a hot green tea that comes out just absolutely steaming hot. All of the food that came out in the beginning, the appetizers and salads, again, were super hot. Like they just came off of whatever they were cooked on, whatever they were made on. The fish was so fresh. Everything came out presented just beautifully. The Red Snapper is one of my favorite sushis to get and it really did not disappoint. The rice had a really good taste and that fish had that fresh fish taste. Now here, if you know, then you know. Again, the Yellowtail is one of my favorite selections for new eaters because in my opinion, it's such a mild flavored fish, but it's packed with so much flavor. Megan is, as you can see, learning how to use chopsticks. So this is a little trick that I learned uh, in a Japanese restaurant probably 20 years ago. And here we have my absolute favorite sushi, sashimi, however you get it, in the world. I love bunagi. I get it everywhere we go. It's one of my favorites and it is so amazing here. So full of flavor, so fresh, and just the perfect, perfect consistency. All right, friends, so there you have it. We uh, originally filmed yesterday, but we got back, the file was corrupted, so we're just gonna do the ending again today. Um, the food at Umami is good, the sushi is fresh, um, it's a great place if you're looking for a quick stop for sushi, uh, maybe for some Korean barbecue. You know, I, I believe they have um, the little tabletop grills that you can get. Um, I think maybe that's just for dinner. I don't know. It wasn't while we were there. But uh, like I said, great place to stop for sushi, stop for drinks, and stop for air conditioning because if you come here in the summer, it is miserably hot. So make sure to give uh, following Florin a follow on Instagram and YouTube. And if you like today's video, make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and we will see you on day five.